I am headed off for a mom's day out and we have a dear friend who recently lost her mother and we are going to surprise her in honor of her mom and kind of steal her away for the day. She has four young children and so I'm sure it's going to be a welcome break for her to get out of the house and go shopping and get coffee and uh, get some food. So we are gonna go surprise her and I'm gonna try to catch that for you guys. Okay, it is cold. I'm walking down to my sister's house again. If some of you don't know, she lives just right down the street from me on the same road. And I've got two of my boys down at my mom's and one at my sister's. Okay, it's a cool, brisk morning. You can even see my breath. Okay, we're again headed to my friend's house to surprise her. If I know my sister Tara, she should catch me on the road because she's very prompt and she should be here within the next minute or two. Oh, you guys, it's cold. Oh my word. I'm not used to being up and at them and outside this early when it's this cold. What did I tell you? Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am bringing you a ladies day out and a thrift haul for you guys. We have our little lady shopping group that goes uh, on a regular basis throughout the year and shops. So, uh, we decided to surprise her and took her off for the day and we went shopping and it was uh, before Christmas. So it was Christmas was in the air and we got to see the town with the lights and we kept driving around this beautiful church that had beautiful lights on it and we were making jokes and laughing and I'll insert a clip of that. <laughs> I just wonder. <laughs> I have no idea. I would, we're going to get all angles. I would do that to you, Mary, yeah, but not Sarah. Oh, of course not. Oh, and this side's like dull. Look at it. <laughs> There's like no light. I'm going to go around. I'm going to turn right. Two strings of lights. Oh, my word. Okay, this is so pretty. I'm just gonna let you take a picture and then you can just send it to me. Nice video, and are you taking a picture? Tara would slow There's down. There's a right behind me. He's following me. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, that was that was a special moment. On that note, the older you get, the more you realize how beautiful and what a blessing it is to have friends and to be able to go and spend time like that.
so, and we ate and, oh my goodness, we stopped at two coffee shops. And yeah, our time together was a definite blessing. And I'm gonna bring you the thrift haul items that I got. In fact, I'm gonna show you how I displayed uh, one of them because I've already redecorated my living room after the holidays. We've got this tie rack, okay? And it was $2, there we go. So I'm going to try, try my husband's ties on these. If one of you know how this works, okay? Like do you, obviously I guess you hang it this way. Anyhow, this nice tie rack, okay, for $2. And it's so, it's so vintage and actually it's beautiful even just how it is. Like it's just, cause look at the quality, okay? In fact, my sister and I just had this discussion because we were redecorating her living room cause we took down her Christmas decor and we were tired. And so like at that moment we were like, basically is it even worth it to thrift and pick up items or do we want to just start going and buying it at like a department store? But then when you see all the vintage items displayed, I am reminded of like, okay, that's why I thrift and, and it's so economical. Okay, so there's the tie rack. I had started collecting Falls Graft maybe last year, about a year ago, give or take. And look, uh, when we were shopping, one of my girlfriends found this and neither of them wanted this. So I was able to get it and they're both falls graft. Okay. So I now have the gravy boat to this very, uh, very plain, simply designed China set. So I have the canisters to this and I have the creamer, the sugar, and now I have the gravy boat. I don't know if I have anything else. Anyhow, yeah, there we go. So we, and what did I pay for him? Oh my, okay, I paid $6. So that seems kind of high, but if you went and bought a gravy boat, just like at Target, it would not be probably $6. My sisters stay ahead of the times more than I do. And I guess record players are like, I think the thing, I guess, I'm not sure. But they both have one. So now of course I want one. So look at these old vintage records. This is Beethoven, okay? And these were four or five for a dollar at a thrift store we went to. Yeah, four or five for a dollar. I mean, can you beat that price? And see, it's got several, let's see. Oh, some are missing. So we've got one. Oh my goodness, you got <laughs> several different pockets and there's only one record in here. But, oh well. So we've got Beethoven, okay? So you break that down. This was around 25, what, 25, 30 cents for him. Then I got the world's greatest waltzes. So, and these are put out by Reader's Digest, okay? So, and let's see, does this have, this has one, two, let me see. Look, he's in that little paper, World's Greatest Waltzes. Another one. And I can't wait to play this. So like, I'm, look, I'm imagining like my house is cleaned and it's evening and then I'm playing my record player. <laughs> so, okay, this one came with three for 30 cents, give or take, okay? 30 cents of entertainment. And then I got, okay, the first thrift store we went to I wasn't finding much and I was bored. And of course, uh, some of the ladies were still shopping. So I walked over to the, it was like a, a sewing section. Oh my word, you guys. Okay. I found a collection of metal scissors. Oh my goodness. Imagine these 
all grouped together in a setting. In fact, we went to an antique store later on and my friend pointed out, she's like, look, in their display, they had old an old pair of old metal scissors for sale, okay? 50 cents. And you know what? I'm actually gonna look into sharpening these as well because I want, I want to be able to really use, okay? These are heavy. Look at this. I mean, aren't those beautiful? And I can even tighten it up if I need to. 50 cents for these vintage or vintage looking old scissors. Just absolutely beautiful. And again, reminds me of why I thrift and don't buy my decor or most of it at just your regular department stores. Look at that, okay? That's one pair. There is so many pairs here. Uh, we've got these, these were a dollar, and these look like they say, what do they say, Swiss? Seems like that would, would wanna have said Swiss, but I don't see the S. Okay, these were a dollar, beautiful black handle. Okay, these look so old. Look at those, and these are so little. He was probably 50 cents. Okay, a little pair and another pair. He's like, almost has a medical look to him. Isn't that beautiful? 50 cents and they say Michigan Cutlery Company. Okay, there we go. And then we've got these last two pair. These say, Oh, there, so there must be a make called Wiss of scissors. I might have to look that up because that's the second pair that has W-I-S-S -S on it. 50 cents, okay? Oh my, third pair, Wiss, Wiss USA, okay? And he has the beautiful black handle, 50 cents. So one, two, three, four, five, Six. I mean, that is an instant collection of metal scissors. I was excited. They were all in the same location and at rock bottom prices. So my goal is to probably, I might display one pair on my knife magnet in my kitchen and then use it as kitchen and with it being metal, I can really get it sanitized. So there we go. An instant collection of metal scissors. If you can't tell, I'm excited about this. This is so neat. Last week, I told you guys about my hallway that I'm going to be organizing with baskets, okay? So I got this basket, it was $5. I, if you shop for baskets, you know the prices of them. And the nowadays ones can sometimes have a manufactured look. It doesn't have the vintage look to them. He's pretty nice size. So he's rounded. You've got the little print in the front. So if he fits, I don't know if I'm gonna display him like this on the shelves, okay? Or you'll see him from like the back. And I can put um, like first aid kits in here cause that's what's in the hallway. So we'll just know that there is like band-aids and what have you in here. So not sure. But $5 for this basket. Yeah, we got, that is my thrift haul from Our Ladies Day Out. And thank you guys for being here for this. And if you haven't, hit the subscribe button and stay tuned for more upcoming videos. And thank you for being here as I create Cottage Diaries.